number one in NCAA Division III. Football is an important part of the campus life at Wittenberg. It is a Saturday afternoon happening. The students, faculty, and citizens of Springfield have traditionally rallied around the Tigers. But there is much more to Wittenberg than football. First and foremost, Wittenberg's academic program is nationally ranked, and the students are here because they want a good education. Academics mean a lot to me, so I started looking for schools that had uh, high academic standards and uh, um, excellent uh, football programs. And uh, Wittenberg was recommended to me, and uh, I came down here, and the people were just super, and uh, I mean. It, you can walk around here anywhere and uh, you know practically everybody and uh, it's just a good experience down here. Well, it was um, rated one of the top 10 best colleges in Ohio and I wanted to go somewhere where I could get a good education. Plus for me, it's close enough to home to where I can go home if I want to, or far enough away, you know, to where I can get away and stay away from home. Well, I think the thing I like most about teaching at Wittenberg is the, uh, the very close interaction with students between students and faculty. That kind of relationship, that kind of warmth, you can call it perhaps, or trust, you can call it, that permeates the classroom is very important to a learning environment. I like the, uh, the environment here. I like getting to know the people I work with. I like knowing all of my students on a first name basis. Um, I like having my door open most of the day and having them uh, feel very comfortable coming in, talking to me. Um, asking me questions, and I enjoy that part of it probably more than anything else. I really uh, like Wittenberg because, well, one, the, the people here really are extremely nice, and uh, kids on the football team and everything are real down-to-earth people, and uh, everybody gets along pretty well, so uh, I really enjoy it because I, I, can, I get along with most everybody, and, and it's just fun to be here. I think, well, I think it's a really great school. I mean, it's, it's small enough for me to where if I need help with my classes, I can get it. The classes are real small where you can be one-to-one -one with your teacher. You know, especially like a big school, you'd be just a number. You know, they call you by your number. Here, the teachers know you by your name. And if you get in trouble, the teacher, you know, they ask you if you have any problems, come in and see them, come in and talk to them. You can always get help. I love it. It's, I wouldn't, I'm glad I made this pick. It's a great school. And um, I'm really happy that... Um, my academics, uh, along with my athletics, are uh, going along just, just great. Wittenberg is synonymous with Division III football. There is no other small college team in the nation which can match the rich history and tradition of Tiger football. Fall Saturday afternoons are special on the campus as the tradition continues. Well, I remember, I, I like to go to athletic events. I'm a cheerleader, so I'm someone who really enjoys supporting a team and, you know, cheering them on and letting them know that there's people out there that really care that they do well and, you know, really appreciate their talents. Wittenberg truly is the king of Division Three football. Wittenberg's 504 all-time victories leads the nation's NCAA Division III schools. There is no other football program in the nation which has sustained consistently on the field their success longer than Wittenberg. Not Penn State, not Nebraska, not Ohio State, not Notre Dame. Wittenberg has 33 consecutive winning seasons. It's the best in all of college football. Wittenberg has won more than 80% of its games since 1955. That's the year that National Football Foundation Hall of Famer Bill Edwards established the Wittenberg tradition. This record is unmatched in Ohio collegiate football. Wittenberg's trophy cases are full of championship trophies, with more on the way. In 31, it would probably be prestige, pride, tradition. It's a lot of prestige here, and it's like when you go through the tunnels before the game, you think all the great players on the walls and everything that don't walk through the same tunnel, and it's a lot, you take a lot of pride in that. Wittenberg 
uh, has the best tradition in any Division three school in America, I would say. Uh, you know, we have 33 win consecutive winning seasons, and, and we've won all those national championships and OAC titles. So you can look from the plaques on the wall here, and uh, you can see a strong tradition out here. And as Timmy said, you know, five national championships, and uh, a lot of people come here just to be a part of it. And uh, being a Tiger is um, <clears throat> a big honor around here. And everybody goes after a Tiger you play. Everybody wants to beat you. Wittenberg is a member of the Ohio Athletic Conference. Their players are nationally recognized. In 1987, eight Tigers were named to the all-conference team. Junior offensive tackle Eric Horseman was named first team All-American by Kodak. Junior offensive guard Ken Bonner was named second team Little All-American by the Associated Press. In addition, junior 1,000-yard rusher Tony Barrett and senior wide receiver Jim Collins were honorable mention All-Americans. The tradition doesn't just happen. It requires long hours of preparation and hard work. Yes, it's tough. It's very tough. But if you work hard enough, everyone gets a chance to play. usually translates into fun in Tiger Stadium on Saturday afternoon. Wittenberg has won 90% of its home games since 1955. Wittenberg's 1987 football team accomplished much. It received wide acclaim for becoming the first in NCAA Division III to reach 500 victories. That coming in a 26-25 come-from-behind victory over two-time defending conference champion Mount Union. Wittenberg also secured its 33rd consecutive winning season, the best such streak in all of college football. And they beat two conference champions, Hope College of Michigan and Capital University of the Ohio Conference. The year 1988 promises to be an exciting one for Wittenberg football with 33 lettermen and 13 starters back. The offense led by All-American lineman Eric Horseman and Ken Bonner should provide the holes for All-American tailback Tony Barrett and the protection for record-breaking quarterback Tim Green. The defense will be led by Captain Tim Watson and will have a great deal of promise with seven starters back. 